Hello, I am Ice Beast, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2. So, uh, but right before I started the last episode, I confirmed that the Abbasids do, in fact, have a uh, f approximately four-year truce with us. So I'm actually going to use this opportunity to declare war on Khazaria. We're going to subjugate uh, all of this land here. We should get a decent return on it, so let's just do that right away. That, that should be a ton of land that we should be able to get from this, if at all possible. Let's get our troops assembling. We'll lower these 156 dudes. They're not important. So yeah, we're going to get everybody assembling right up here. Let's go up to speed like normal. Meanwhile, the Khazarians or the Abbasids are in the middle of a uh, war against... Oh, wow. That just completely went against the Abbasids. That's real interesting. I wonder what happened. Uh, did you guys see that? It went from like 94% to 49%. I was going to say that it was about to, uh, about to be won by the Abbasids with the Ab the the Byzantines have managed to turn it real quick there. That was real interesting. Isn't there a... Uh... So the German Holy War is going in the German favor. The Crusade is going in the Crusader's favor. The Peasant Revolt is going in the Umayyad's favor. Otherwise, this is going perfectly fine. Yeah, otherwise everything's going great. Sorry, I thought I heard something and I was trying to listen to for outside noises. So yeah, I apologize if I got a little quiet there for a second. Wait, I was sort of trying to continue my f my train of thought and listen for uh, for noises in case I was being called. It's what happens when you're trying to do multiple things at the same time. All right, so let's get going. We're going to come up here and immediately siege this holding, which should allow us to, to at least get rid of any ticking war score that they might have. I'm really curious what's going on in this war. I really wish I could see the war. Oh, wow, Germany just won their war against the Umayyads. This is really interesting. What's going on over here? I mean, I think everything is really interesting, just for clarity. Wait, so wait, you're the Duke of Armenia? Wait, what the hell's going on here? There's an Ar You're owned by Armenia? That's odd. And why the hell do I have such a suddenly have a dangerous faction? And why are you in this faction? I know why you're in it. You don't like me. Let's make you the master of the bow. Let's send you a gift. Let's send you a gift. We can make you a uh, cupbearer. Sure, that's fine. That should get all of these guys out of this faction, like, right away. Um, it's this one. Let's get noble customs. That should give us another 10 bonus against these guys. 4th of December. Possibly crush 5,000 dudes. Let's make sure I got good leaders going. Okay, he gives me a bonus to mounted troops. He gives me just a pretty good general bonus. And he doesn't do anything, but that's okay. This gives me a thing on the Sheikdom of Kermansa, which is this, right? This is the Sheikdom, not the Emirate. I want the Emirate. All right, um, let it go. Let it go. I know I've, I've sung that song slash made that joke multiple times already. I feel like this is still going in the Caliph's favor. Because I keep seeing armies raise up here. He's still got tw almost 20,000 dudes. Oh, we're, we're suffering attrition. Get out of there. It's not a huge attrition, but it is an attrition. I'm now ill. That sucks. I really don't want to die. So please, don't be ill. What the hell? You are so fast. Is this a teleporter here? 28th of June? Yeah, okay, we will catch that army, so that's good. My wife is pregnant. I am no longer wounded. That's a bonus. 
All right, so we're crushing this army. Beautiful. Beautiful, and then we'll chase you down. Try to crush everything you believe in. 20th of March. God, marching around up here is so slow. I always forget how slow it is. After we subjugate these territories, now, yes, it is good to notice that these territories really suck when it comes to, uh, when it comes to troops and everything like that. But it will give me a, a decent influx of troops once they get the recently conquered modifier removed. And that might be enough to, to sort of forestall the Abbasids from continuing warring against us. They still have 40,000 dudes. Holy shit. All right, so we should it shouldn't take very long to start sieging these territories, which is good. We're probably yeah um, Taking some war hits War score hits for not controlling the territory. That's fine. We're probably losing money. Yes, we are losing a butt ton of money My new heir needs an educator, so we will educate him ourselves. I'm trying to betroth him. I always do that educate child Oh, we suffered some attrition. Of course we did. Do we have anybody to sell? Got some people to execute. Okay, we're going to sell you for 70 gold. And um, we're definitely going to give our son Zealous. We're going to execute you. Didn't get any gold for executing you. We're going to execute you. Did get some gold for executing you. Had a daughter. Okay. He's cool. And you're going to prison. Which I can then use to sell you for 25 gold. That's all not bad at all. Alright, good. So we've sold you. This is going to be a lot of territory we're going to gain. 32% war score. There's 6,000 dudes. We'll be good to crush them. It'll take us 10 periods to, to crush this army. These guys will... they not sieging? No, they're not sieging. Interesting. You're going this way. Okay, very interesting. I'm seeing if this is any of my guys. I don't think it is. No. I was curious if any of my vassals had decided to try to expand. It doesn't look like there's any expansion plans going on in the Empire. Wow, you are starting to lose favor in this war. That's real interesting. I mean, the Byzantines are having a bad time, but this whole thing is incredibly interesting to me. So I see that they're trying to loop around. This will give them an actually a pretty decent little army. It's going to take me two months' time to, uh, or 20 days to, to do this. Okay, good. Let's go. 3rd of March, 24th of March. Alright, now if I come down here. 17th of March. Assuming this army is going to go march away here in a minute. Yeah, fighting these armies is going to be a lot better than trying to siege all these holdings. Of course, we're actually losing somehow. I don't get how we're losing this battle. We have a numerical advantage. We have a troop type advantage. Okay, we won the battle, but I'm not happy with what happened there. Then I want to see... Okay, why are you still in this, you goddamn bastard? I'll send you a gift. Maybe that will get you out of it. Let's uh, send you a gift. And that will get you out of... Should get you out of the... Uh, the faction. Wow, we are surprisingly slow in the, the chasing down of this army. Really need to auto-balance this army as well. Come on. Now, we're going to get here before you pop. You guys just keep doing your little dance. Um... So you're saying 
Chief Arong is imprisoned. What does this guy think of me? He's okay with me. Chief Yazede, he's also okay with me. Yeah, let's uh let's let's back off. Alright, much better here. He must have had a weird breakdown of forces. Which was causing problems. Fifty-nine percent war score is real good already. I can't believe we've lost almost half our men, though. Who can I raise up? Just these five hundred dudes. You guys just go home. So we do have a numerical advantage. We're about to land. I want to auto balance as best I can. All right, here we go. That puts our center as our weakest flank, which is not surprised that this happened, but. We're shit. Why is this happening? Jesus Christ. Okay, we won the battle, but that was real bad. That was real bad. Okay, what did I just inherit? This. Found it. Alright, um... Our son could lose Craven and 25% chance he becomes brave. Well, let's... Didn't become brave, unfortunately. Yeah, down to only 4,000 dudes is not good. It's really not good. We're probably losing a butt ton of money. How did you almost get back to full here? What the hell just happened? Oh, now we're the defenders somehow. Okay, this just reversed. I was so confused about what happened there. God, this guy's real good, or his troops are real good. Now we're going over here. Okay. We captured or slew somebody in battle, I believe. Who is this guy? He's not contributing to war score at all, is he? No, he's not. Okay, good. Send. That's just making sure that we're not uh, rancing away somebody who's giving me an advantage. Okay, let's come back down to here. We're up, uh, already up to 800 uh, or 82% war score, which is good. Which is good, good, good. We are also very close to uh, being able to be warred again by the Abbasids. Which would be real good to end this before they can strike against us. Now luckily they're still involved with the Basilius. So that is good for us. We're going to be there soon. Hello. Good. Good. If we capture that guy in battle, it be real good. But we couldn't. We continue our sort of circle of... of death and destruction. Yeah, we're doing... We're low on men. Not happy about this. But we will just arrive to crush these guys here in a second. Is this mountains? Step. I really do need to, uh, you know, start... Attrish or sieging down other provinces. Who can I imprison? Why can I imprison you? I don't know why I can imprison you, but okay. Beautiful. 89% war score. My daughter came of legal age. Good for her. So you... You're okay. You, you're ish. And you, you're okay. Okay, got it. Can I get you before you escape? 3rd of August, 23rd of August. No, I cannot. What if I come here? 27th of August, 14th of September for a decent portion of that army. This is actually good for us to try to intercept this army before it escapes. 
So 700 of these guys are going to get away, but another... Nope, they're turn, they turned around. Okay, interesting. Beautiful. That was a nice, easy engagement. We're going to leave those guys behind because those other guys are probably crossing this way, I'm guessing. If we defeat that army in a battle, which we will, they're heading up to Kipchak on the 18th of November. So when and if we defeat this army in battle, we will be able to effectively win this war, I believe. Just find out how long it'll take us to get there. It'll take us almost a full month to get there. Okay. Let's go. 19th of December, 28th of December. Let's get over here. How did I just get more land? Oh, I, I lost a trade or something like that. Or my wife must have. Yeah, my wife gained mnemonic. If she dies, then we'll get a new wife. Oh, beautiful. Money. Pick an ambition. So my wife did just die of pneumonia. Let's find... So our ambition is going to be, of course, get married. Then we're going to find a wife. Can we find a genius? There are no geniuses. Uh, quick. Nobody quick that is marri marriable. All right. So then we will just find whoever has... This thing has gotten confused. Let's try it again. There we go. All right, so you, ooh, you're 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 not too bad at all, and you're Zunist. So let's marry you. That should also help get my domain back into the right size. Why are you guys always factioning? Why are you always in factions? Um. So you're coming down here. You'll be there on the 30th of January. How long will it take me to get here, by the way? Almost that longer, actually. You'll get there on the 6th of March. I don't have to worry about you. Now, let's get back to the faction. Why do you not like me? Send gift. No. Award honorary title. Shit, didn't need to do that. Send gift. No, okay. Let's come on down and fight this army. D did not really want to designate that guy as my regent, by the way, but that's okay. Oh, they're coming in with an additional 1,400 men. They'll get there on the 11th of March. I will arrive on the 21st of March. You'll arrive on the 5th of April. Which surprisingly gives them almost enough to win that battle. God damn it. Why are... Is, oh, because... Oh, no. We're the attackers. Okay, good. Whew, it's like, why is my left completely collapsing? Now, their center guy is so good. Come on. There we go. Beautiful. War is over. We also captured a bunch of D-bags in battle, but... Look at that, guys. Holy crap. I got a lot more territory than I expected. I got way more territory than I expected. Why are you, why did you get all this territory? A bit confused why this guy got all of this territory. What was your territory before? Chief of Perm, Ak Wait, this guy's not my Grand Vizier says he's my Grand Vizier, but he's not. Yeah, that was the old guy's Grand Vizier. Okay. Apparently, this is... Everybody go home. You march back down here. Apparently, this kingdom is in... Um, a diff has a different set of laws. Shadam of... Whatchamacallit. I'm going to raise the crown authority to low. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's going to be an interesting uh, challenge here. Can I revoke that title? Can I just be like... No, I am the Shah. I am the law. Yeah, we're never going to get that, that law passed. And I'm over my vassal limit. All right, let's see what we got here. Let's look at the Dejure duchies real quick. We don't control that. Sir Daria, we don't control that. Does anyone here? Um, and this guy is gonna be pretty strong. Can I just like imprison you? Nope. All right, what can we make a, a duchy out of real quick here? Well, I know I'm, I know I'm going over a little over, but the Raj of Lahore. So we've already formed this one. Pretty sure we've already formed that one. Got Coruscant. I think my real only option here is to take a little bit of a risk. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you. I'm going to uh, transfer vassalage of uh, Sabir. That's not Sabir. Who are you? You're Koza of Sabir. All right, you. Transfer vassalage. Koza of Sabir. All right, here we go. Congratulations. You have a new lord. I'm going to nominate, of course, my son and heir to be the king of this kingdom. And that is where we're going to end the episode. So thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. We have greatly uh, grown the empire here. We are an agnatic elective gavel kind. Which is very interesting. I'd like to go to Ultimo Genitor in that land as well. But that's okay. If we lose the title, we lose the title. Uh, with that all being said, I thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will see you all next time.